Hey guys, Cal with Blacklisted. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this little animation that I created to show you what's better, a car that's just ceramic coated or a car that has PPF with ceramic coating. In having a conversation with my good friend Eddie over at 3D Products of the Valley, he said, hey, after you did that ceramic coating on the PPF, the car wasn't even dusty. So let me show you what went through my mind and what I thought about. So in this graphic, you could see the wind blowing, the car going, and you could see the trees and the wind as well. The top car, PPF with ceramic coating, creates a barrier so that the wind doesn't create static on the car because the PPF is non-conducive. Now, the car on the bottom, the PPF with ceramic coating will go into the wind and the metallic parts on the vehicle are going to be charged with static electricity and as you can see here on top the wind is just simply going to go over the car as aerodynamically as possible where the car on the bottom is going to create some static charges on the metallic panels as we do know that some panels are carbon fiber but that alone will cause static cling which will then create dust and debris that will cling to your vehicle. So in conclusion, if you can PPF your vehicle and have blacklisted auto detailing, ceramic coat the PPF. And if not, having blacklisted auto detailing, ceramic coat your car is better than having no protection at all. So that does this to these two vehicles in the graphic. Imagine what happens to vehicles that don't have either a coating or a PPF. Thanks for watching. And that's the science of detailing.